Ugandan vanilla farmers face poverty and disease on an unimaginable scale. Most adults will not live past 45. Income for a third of the population is less than a dollar a day. In some villages, four out of ten people have HIV or AIDS. And malaria kills a fifth of children under five. Since 2007, Firmanish has been working with Uvan, Uganda's biggest vanilla processor, to help farmers improve the quality and value of their vanilla, make sure that they're paid better prices, and to set up other projects to help tackle poverty and disease. The project team are training farmers to grow better beans and to extend their farm activities to earn more money. People, first of all, learn how to grow vanilla. It's very, very important for them because that's one of the income generating activity which they have. Other activities like poultry keeping and things like that, it all adds up to the extra income which they need very badly. Working with Care International, Firmanish are helping farmers set up village savings and loans associations, or VSLAs, so they can save money and take out small loans. VSLA in four is village savings and loan associations. There are no immediate financial services available in this community. So what VSLA has done is the women now are empowered to mobilize their own funds. Small, small amounts of money, but eventually they create a big fund which they access and are able to invest in those income generating activities. Some have bought land, some have bought animals, some are beginning to uh, put up structures uh, so that they can, they can get the benefit of getting poultry in the future. Firmanish have also helped the project team give the farmers training on the prevention and control of AIDS and malaria. For HIV, we create awareness about the disease. For people to know that the disease is very dangerous, we train them how to avoid it. And for malaria, we give out mosquito nets. We train them how to control the disease when you're sick, you cannot produce. And if you cannot produce, you can't be rich. So when you train them how to avoid these diseases, they can save money. Firmalish are also working with Uvan to improve their production processes and the hygiene, quality and flavor of their beans. Process starts with uh, receiving the beans, checking them, weighing them. Sort them, of course, very well to make sure that there are no foreign material. Then we start doing the washing in cold water, then in hot water. We put them on conveyor. At the same time, we are doing the selection as well. Then we do the cutting. Our business here is in cut beans. And then we put them in pans, and then we start putting them in sweating tanks. With the granted market, then they can continue growing it. Once they know that Yuvan is connected with an international reputable company, they are encouraged because they know that we are here today, tomorrow, and the day after. I'm happy that Feminish thought about funding this project. It's a wonderful project. It has helped them live a better life, like they can afford to buy food for themselves, pay for the shelter, and they also seek medical medical care from the money that they get paid, and also educate their children. Their lives have improved, their families are happy, their husbands are supportive because they, they encourage them to come and meet because they know there's something great to benefit out of it. My family is really very, 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 very happy with the project. Whenever my children come back, you find them carrying the, the poultry. They enjoy it very much. They have, they have realized that it is supporting them to keep at school. It is supporting their health. The future, to, to me, uh, looks very bright.